Ever wonder what happened to your favorite childhood stars? From breakout roles to vanishing acts, join us as we delve into the stories of over 40 actors who mysteriously disappeared from the Hollywood spotlight. So let's begin. Rick Moranis, Ghostbusters, took a long hiatus from acting after his wife's death to focus on raising his children. Molly Ringwald, The Breakfast Club, continued acting but largely in smaller roles and TV projects. Brendan Fraser, The Mummy, dealt with health issues and personal struggles that affected his career. Freddie Prinze Jr., She's All That, focused on voice acting and started a family with Sarah Michelle Gellar. Jonathan Taylor Thomas, Home Improvement, left the spotlight to focus on his education and personal life. Phoebe Cates, Fast Times at Ridgemont High, retired from acting to focus on her family and boutique business. Michael Schofling, 16 Candles, quit acting and became a carpenter and woodworker. Gene Hackman, The French Connection, retired from acting in 2004 to focus on writing novels. Mike Myers, Austin Powers series, took longer breaks between projects and focused on personal life. Joe Pesci, Goodfellas, semi-retired from acting, appearing only occasionally in films. Andrew McCarthy, Pretty in Pink, transitioned to directing and travel writing. Emilio Estevez, The Breakfast Club, focused on directing and writing with occasional acting roles. Bridget Fonda, single white female, retired from acting after a car accident and focused on her family. Gina Davis, Thelma and Louise, continued acting but also focused on activism and founded the Gina Davis Institute on Gender in Media. Carrie Ann Moss, The Matrix, continued acting but in fewer high-profile roles. Skeet Ulrich, Scream, continued acting in TV shows and smaller films. Ali Sheedy, The Breakfast Club, continued acting in independent films and TV shows. Bridget Moynihan, Coyote Ugly, continued acting in TV shows and films but in supporting roles. Rupert Everett, My Best Friend's Wedding, focused on writing and European projects. Lori Petty, Tank Girl, continued acting in smaller roles and TV shows. Thora Birch, American Beauty, continued acting but in fewer high-profile roles. Feruza Balk, The Craft, continued acting in independent films and TV shows. Michael Bion, The Terminator, continued acting in smaller roles and independent films. Steven Dorff, Blade, continued acting but in fewer high-profile roles. Rachel Lee Cook, She's All That, continued acting in TV shows and smaller films. Vincent Carthizer, Mad Men, focused on theater work and smaller TV roles after Mad Men ended. Larissa Olenek, The Secret World of Alex Mack, continued acting in TV shows and smaller films. Kel Mitchell, Keenan and Kel, continued acting in smaller roles and ventured into ministry. Jay Davidson, The Crying Game, 
retired from acting and pursued a career in fashion. Jack Gleason, Game of Thrones, retired from acting after his role as Joffrey Baratheon to focus on academics. Amanda Bynes, The Amanda Show, faced personal struggles and legal issues, leading to a hiatus from acting. Taylor Lautner, Twilight Series, struggled to find success in post-Twilight roles and focused on smaller projects. Eric Pear Sullivan, Malcolm in the Middle, stepped away from acting to focus on personal life and education. Frankie Muniz, Malcolm in the Middle, pursued interests in racing and music with occasional acting roles. Mark Hamill, Star Wars Original Trilogy, focused on voice acting and smaller roles between Star Wars trilogies. Linda Blair, The Exorcist, continued acting in smaller roles in B-movies. Peter Ostrom, Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory, chose not to pursue acting and became a veterinarian. Danny Lloyd, The Shining, quit acting and became a biology professor. Jeff Cohen, The Goonies, retired from acting and became an entertainment lawyer. Charlie Corsmo, Hook, quit acting to pursue a career in law and academia. Ariana Richards, Jurassic Park, focused on her art career and occasional acting roles. Michael Oliver, Problem Child, left acting and has stayed out of the public eye. Ross Bagley, the Fresh Prince of Bel-Air, continued acting in smaller roles and pursued a career in real estate. Carrie Henn, Aliens, chose not to pursue acting and became a teacher. Danny Pintoro, who's the boss, continued acting in smaller roles and became an LGBTQ activist.